Right, so I'm going to quickly show you guys how to get infinite money on the original Fable. This is the one on the original Xbox. Uh, I'm pretty sure this works on TLC and probably Anniversary. They're all borderline the same game. But considering this is the original Fable, we all know the buy and sell glitch doesn't work. So this is your main way to make lots of money really fast. So you want to go to the Bandit Camp and you want to see your boy Bennis. Uh, of course, the guy that does find the edition. And you're going to want to do this before you take the Find the Bandit CRS quest. You can, you know, take the quest and get up to this point and hero save and do it that way. But that just takes far longer. All we've done is we've gone to the Bandit Camp before we needed to. And we are going to do Spot the Edition. Which is a little bit tricky, I will say. It's not exactly something that I found very enjoyable. And you're just going to want to do this until you get past all five rounds. I tend to actually repeat it to myself out loud, so I manage to do it. I'm not very good at these whole edition game things. They just don't work very well for me. But once you do all this, it takes about 30 seconds or so. We'll just wait for me to do it here. As you can see, I, I do take my time. Some people can do this extremely fast. I am unfortunately not one of those people. So, as you can see, we've just completed all five rounds and uh, we've won. So after this, you know, we just leave, we won our one gold, and then we just need to teleport back to the Heroes Guild. Um, this is quite useful for us because we can now take the quest for Find the Bandit CRS, which means we're actually going to be given the uh, Bandit Pass. You won't get the Bandit Pass unless you're on the quest. Benis, our boy, unfortunately will not give that to you when you're not doing the quest. So now I've got the quest, we just want to go straight back to uh, Twin Blades Camp. And we're going to, uh, in my case, because I don't have the uniform and all this, if you've got the uniform, you can go straight through the door or whatever. Uh, I, um, you know, of course, you know, I've, I've clipped my way through here, so I'm just going to clip my way back through the gate, which can be uh, really useful. And, uh, yep, here I am messing it up a few times, because, of course, I am extremely professional at this game. And, uh, yeah, we just need to get all the way down back to our boy, Benis, who is going to... Uh, because we've already completed his game, give us the Bandit Camp Pass, I think it's called. So as soon as you talk to him, he'll be like, yes, you're so smart, here, have the Bandit Camp Pass. And then when he sits back down at the table, uh, you'll be able to do spot the edition, and you just saw that down in the bottom left, we now have loads and loads of money. But to get the game out of this glitch state, you just want a world save, or hero save, depending on whatever your options are. And I just over over overwrit save five, I'm pretty sure that's how you say it, um, and, uh, and load again. And as you'll be able to see here, once the game actually loads, because the joys of loading on console takes a little while, um, we now have 9,000, or well, 9, 9 million, some crazy amount of money that you can get in the game. Pretty much the maximum you can get. And, uh, yeah, that you can use that on whatever you want. So, as you can see, I can try and go over to the traders who are all asleep, because it's still early morning. Uh, but it does pop up in the bottom left saying that we have loads of money. So, if this video was helpful, um, do whatever you want with it. It's quite helpful for OG Fable and the limited glitches you actually have.